In this quick video I'm going to show you Android Gingerbread running an open Pandora. Everything's been already installed, so uh, we have to go to the menu. We go further down, down to system, and we go for the Android Gingerbread. So we start the application and it should oh right, it's asking for a password. So uh, there we go. And uh, Right, it's built in up now. There's Android logo, there's Open Pandora logo, a bit smaller on the right hand side, and uh, that's the built in up screen. It shouldn't take too long to boot up, and uh, it is quite quick. There we go. As I said, it didn't take too long. Uh, I do have a wireless. Wi-Fi, wireless network, Wi-Fi, that's what I've meant. And uh, it just came up with a small indication just over there. Majority of you will be quite familiar with the Android system, so let's go for the menu. That's the one. And as we can clearly see, it does work with no problem. And uh, I have tried few applications some of them work, some of them don't, but uh, to my surprise, even certain games work. But uh, let's start from the Amazon Kindle. We all know what Amazon Kindle Reader is. And uh, this is the Android version. It works like a charm. So uh, that's the only book I've uh, just put for testing. It's a Sherlock Holmes. So let's give it a try. It's loading and uh, there we go. We can use uh, D-pad on the left hand side to scroll through the pages and uh, the touch screen also works. So that's perfectly fine. And uh, next one's going to be Angry Birds. I have never ever liked this game, but it's quite popular so I can understand uh, certain people like to play it. So there you go, Angry Birds. It takes a while, not a while, it takes a few seconds to load and it should be done now. There you go, as you can clearly see, and here music works. So let's give it a try. Let's go for the seasonal, seasonal one. Moon Festival, I will do. Level one. Right, I feel like doing let's play now, whoops, oh. right, that should do, back to the normal, right, not necessarily, there we go, right, I have to be careful, yeah, there you go, oh, uh, Come on, come on. That was the first bird. Right, that was the second one. So, that's the Angry Birds. Yeah, the game works with no problem. It's quite fast. The music works. No problem. No problems whatsoever. I think that's a. Uh, that's the. Uh, Another try. Right, so uh, we want to quit. Yes, I think it's uh, a bit better now. Quit. I think that's it. No. Right, we'll do it in a different way. Yes, we want to quit. There you go. So, that's Angry Birds for you. I have tried. So install Bard's Tale, but this game needs to download a lot of data, so uh, I gave up. Drag Racing, this is quite a stupid game I think, but it does work. There you go. Let's give it a try. Next, next, next race. 
I think I have to press this one. Alright. Oops. I don't think I'm very good in that game. I'm useless to be honest with you. But yeah, it does work. Now the question how to write. I don't want to. Just go back. Escape. Escape. No, I don't want to play. Just go back. There you go. That's another game. Uh, the Facebook application. It does work with no problems. That's a file manager. Fruit Ninja. It does work. Netflix. This one with this was very surprising to me, but Netflix works with no problems. So uh, that's a great bonus. Uh, I have tried real racing, I'm afraid this game don't work at all. YouTube video. It takes a while, but uh, let's try. Let's go for the bitmap axis which is my account. There we go. And let's have a look on this video. It might take a while to load. I think it's going to take... No! There you go. That's it. That's YouTube, it works with no problem, great application. Uh, I have also tried uh, Sonic, I'll uh, try to, there we go. This is just light version, and I believe it's just a one level, and there will be a lot of clicking. And uh, what's nice about this game is that you can actually use a D-pad to control the game. Uh, no, we're not interested. Let's close this one. Ah, there we go. Main menu. Start game. Here we go for the stage one. And there we are. Okay. Right, so that's the D-pad to control Sonic and we jump by pressing the X button Uh, as you might see, this game is not 100% playable. I mean, it is playable, but uh, it's a little bit laggy. I mean, it's possible to work with no problems, but I think it should be a little bit quicker. But I think it still looks pretty good and pretty impressive. So, uh, that's the Sonic. Right, the question is, how do I... Right, if I want to quit... I have no clue how to do it. Uh, there we go. Exit. Yes, I'm pretty sure I want to exit. So that, that's a Sonic for you. Right. I'll do it in a bit different manner. There you go. Uh, there is a market. I have tried real racing. I'm afraid this game does not work. D-Day Normandy, it's a too laggy to play. Sperm Wars, this uh, Sperm Wars, that's an interesting title. It does work with no problem, there's one more thing I'd like to show you. It's, uh, right, I need to find it first. It is Playstar. It should come up any second. There we go. 
let's go for the applications which is just over there top right corner and the Google market the play market does work as you can see so let's go for the last application let's go for the games uh, featured top page nah, top free that's the one so let's give a try with the doodle jump I'm afraid it is a little bit slow so it takes time so uh, all the pictures everything comes up right if you want to install it we just click on the install icon we accept all the terms and conditions keep shopping doesn't really matter that's 34 megabytes so that's going to download for a quite a while uh, we don't want to wait and don't want to keep you on that screen so uh, we just go back and uh, leave it to download certain applications work I mean the ones I have tried so that's the documents to go no we don't want to register later and off we go fully fledged and uh, I have tried that's the application I use a lot for keeping all the passwords and all the pin codes and all the data and information that's the pocket and I was more than pleased to find this application works uh, yes we want to exit because I'm not going to type my pin number and all my passwords in so uh, that's how it looks like uh, doodle jump is still downloading it's 12% now so I think uh, we can cancel it because I'm not going to wait and I'm going to switch uh, switch the Android off so uh, there we go let's leave it we can right and uh, to leave the Android we have to find uh, the kill Android icon which is just over there press it and uh, we are being logged off A few seconds and we're back to our menu.